Welcome back to Blowout Gaming. What's going on, guys? This is Zach B. I want to go through and have a pretty quick and easy tutorial for you guys on how to stack colors on all of your color regions. I want to give you guys a comprehensive guide on how to color stack. This is the process that I use every single time I want to stack dinos. From beginning to end, I'm going to show you guys. Sometimes just having really colorful dinos is a lot of fun. And you know what? It's a pretty big challenge in this game. So this is going to be a quick, simple process on how to stack color mutations. Smash that like button, guys. Hit the subscribe button, and let's get started. Step number one, guys, is going to be getting our mutations. Now, this is something that most people know, but I'm going to go ahead and make sure that everybody knows. First of all, guys, you get mutations completely randomly. Color mutations are completely random when you are breeding together two dinosaurs. It is in our best interest to collect up and hatch as many eggs as possible. Of course, this also goes the same for any animals that gestate instead of laying eggs. Same thing, you keep them going and eventually they're going to pop out mutations. And if you don't believe me, go check out any of my videos and you will see it's just a matter of time and patience and enough hatching and you guys will get mutations now as you can see i've already done tons and tons of hatching the key is i turned on a bunch of uteranuses and i let them go crazy now as you can see guys we have a bunch of different mutations but the key is to get one mutation that you want to stack together in each individual color region today guys we're going to be going through and taking a look at the uteranus we have the hand mutation the top of the head mutation we have the main body mutation and then we have the stripe on the back super simple and i'm going to take you through we're going to turn it from a plain uteranus into a fully stacked uteranus one color at a time now we only have one male in this bunch actually this is pretty unlucky for us guys because it makes things very difficult when you have way too many of the same gender because it dictates which dino gender you're going to need with the correct mutation stacking so this is going to make things challenging moving forward but we do have our bright green body and then let's go ahead and pick one of these other females and let's stack them together yellow head first let's turn on the mating collect up some eggs i'll meet you upstairs when we're ready to hatch hopefully we get lucky let's see how many eggs it takes step number two our first color stack that's right guys our first two colors stacked together we're looking for that nice green body and that bright yellow head and tail but remember we need a male so let's see exactly how lucky we get now i am going to also do an egg count to see how many eggs this takes us total so far we are at three. We did get our green and yellow. First things first. Okay, guys. So let's see. Is it the male that we need? It is not. It is a female. Okay. So we're going to have to keep going. Let's go ahead and unclaim this. Snugglepuss is going to clean this up. Let's go back down and grab some more eggs. All right. Four more. Let's see how we do. Green and yellow male. Come on, guys. We got this. Nope. Yes. Yes. All right, guys. We have two chances. We need a male. First one, female. Second one, female. Oh, my goodness. Guys, come on. We are not getting lucky. That is another four eggs. I'll clean this up. I'll meet you back here when I have some more. All right, guys. We're back. We have five eggs this time. That's right. Hit that like button if you're enjoying the video. Like I said, guys, we have to get that first stack. There's no two ways around it. I can fast forward through it all I want, but I've got to sit here and hatch them up a few at a time to see if we can get lucky. We're looking for the green with the yellow male. Nope. Another five down. Got to get some more eggs. Man, this is going to be tough tonight, I can tell. All right. I came prepared this time. We've got a bunch more eggs. Let's throw down a few of these. I bet we're gonna get it in this bunch. Usually I can get them within the first 10 eggs. So far we're at 12. And we got another mutation. <laughs> All right, so this is actually good that this popped up guys because I can show you that this is definitely, oh man, it's twins. Uh, this is definitely something that happens all the time. We get these mutations and let's see if this one's a guy because if it is i'll just keep both of them a helpful tip guys whenever you get twins 
if they're opposite genders, keep them both because you never know which one you're going to need later on in your mating. As you can see, we're sitting here waiting for a male. We've seen the female a few times now, uh, but that is a totally different color combination. I actually really like this purple a lot, and I might want to use this purple at the end of this video instead. So we should keep that in mind. I mean, the green on green is cool, but that purple's cooler, right? So let's go ahead and do that together. That way you guys can kind of be a part of it. So we have a few more here. One, two, three, sweet. So hopefully this five, we can get it. I really don't know. Okay, well, we definitely have a few options. So first things first, female second one up female female i have this idea guys because we're gonna go ahead and use these purple neck mutations we just got we can now go ahead and raise up a female version of the green and yellow and then we can use the male purple stripe okay i have an idea this is actually gonna look even cooler guys i think it's already off to a good start let me know in the comments below what you think and then I'm going to go ahead and put this one away, and let's get this purple one out. I think this is a little bit more fun, because then you guys get to see the creative process in motion. All right. Now it looks like that one Uterina totally fell asleep in the corner. <laughs> I'm dying right now. All right. Well, anyway, these two are paying attention. We've got the bright green with the yellow, and we are ready to add on this purple stripe that we got together. Let's go ahead and turn on this mating, collect up a bunch of eggs, and I'll meet you back upstairs. Step number three, adding our second stack. Back for round two, guys. Ready to stack on the next layer. Here we go. How many eggs is it going to take? Maybe we'll get luckier this time. We are looking for the yellow with the green and the purple, and it's got to be a male. So the trifecta here, guys, it's going to be tough. Let's see how lucky we can get. Boom. Oh, my gosh. That looks amazing. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That looks so awesome. Tell me one of these is a male. Yes. <laughs> All right. Just like that. It took us literally 20 eggs for the first stack. And there you go, guys. We just got the third stack. Holy smokes. That looks so awesome. Gosh darn. I'm so glad that we're doing this one together. This looks so cool. <laughs> All right. Come over here. Come over here. What are you doing? Get out of there. Yes. Oh, man. Guys, <laughs> this is going to look so cool when it's all done. And then we have red hands to add to this. Come on, guys. Hit the like button for me. This is awesome. Let's go ahead and get this one raised up. Let me go turn those off. I have two more eggs in my inventory. We don't even need to hatch. This is crazy, guys. The first three eggs. Holy smokes. That was so cool. All right. Let's go back downstairs. Step number three complete. On to step number four. Let's raise this up, swap them out, and get some more eggs. All right, guys. Just like that, we're all grown up. We're ready to start mating. And honestly, this thing is going to turn out so much better than I expected. When we started off, we were going to use a green stripe. And now, because we did the video together, we're going to end up with a purple stripe. I think this is going to look awesome. Step number four, guys, the final stack. It really is just that simple, guys. You start with your mutations and you stack them on one layer at a time. I don't care if you have three color regions, four, five, or six color regions. It really is that simple. The hardest part is just getting the stacks in the right genders. Honestly, it just takes time. We were able to stay flexible and we were able to make it work. And look at that. The video turned out even better. And it's all because of you guys. That's how awesome this is. I'll bring you back when we're upstairs and we're ready to start hatching up for our final fully stacked Uteranus. I'll see you in a sec. All right, guys, we're back upstairs with our next six eggs. Oh, shoot. I forgot to take out the old ones. I think I picked up six. I at least picked up five. <laughs> Let's throw out these. One, two, three, four. And then I think, I think this one was the last one, but whatever. We'll figure it out. We're back with our last bunch of eggs. Let's see if we can get lucky with these four. And then I don't even have to figure out what the last one is. Come on. All four color stacks we're looking for. That's not it. That's not it. Come on. None of the above. Okay. Let's toss out this one. This one could be it. Who knows? The lucky egg. 
This is where my overflow eggs go. I don't eat them all. All right, what do we get? No. Nope, we didn't get it. All right, so we've, we've still got them going downstairs. I didn't think we were going to get it. This is always the hardest. Anything past three, honestly, is where it gets really, really difficult. So let's go ahead and head back in, collect up some more eggs, and we'll try again for the next round. All right, here's another seven. Let's see what we can do. I think we might get lucky. Honestly, we've been doing pretty good so far. 20 in the first round, three in the second round, and so far we've done five in the third round. Here's another seven. First four are out. Let's see what we get. Yes, there it is, guys. That's it right there. It doesn't matter the gender at this point. You can see we have our green body, purple stripe, yellow head with our red hands. We don't even need to throw out the last three eggs. We did it. Male or female, doesn't matter. We got the final stack we were looking for, guys. And what a final stack it is. I think that looks absolutely awesome. Let's go ahead and get this one raised up in the big room and take a look at it. Final three brings us to a final total of 31 eggs to get our fully stacked Uteranus. I think that's pretty good, actually. I'm not going to lie. Usually it takes a whole lot more than that. Yes. Oh, yeah, guys. That is a fully stacked Uteranus. And you know what? That's the reason I do it, because I think that looks absolutely incredible. I love how this one turned out, and I'm so glad we got to do it together. Oh, my gosh. That looks so cool. few simple steps, guys, and you guys will also have the most colorful dinos on your server. Send me photos, link them to my Discord, all of the above. Make sure to hit that like button and the subscribe button, and I expect to see you guys in the next episode. I'll see you later.